You're in your kitchen, surrounded by an array of herbs that you mostly use for seasoning your meals. But what if I told you that these very herbs have a hidden potential, a secret power that could help in the fight against cancer? In this video, let's learn about some of the most powerful herbs that cannot just reduce your risk of cancer, but also have the potential to kill cancer cells. Without any further delay, let's begin. Number 1. Rosemary Rosemary is a remarkable herb commonly found in many kitchens, and it has a significant role to play in the battle against cancer. This herb is rich in many antioxidants, especially rosmarinic acid and carnosol. They work by neutralizing harmful molecules known as free radicals, which, if left unchecked, can contribute to cancer development. In addition to its antioxidant properties, rosemary also has anti-inflammatory abilities. Inflammation can promote cancer growth, and rosemary helps reduce this inflammation, creating an environment that is less favorable for the development and progression of cancer cells. One more fascinating aspect of rosemary is its ability to promote apoptosis in cancer cells. Apoptosis is basically our body's natural process to kill bad or abnormal cells. Rosemary has been shown to encourage this process in cancer cells, preventing their uncontrolled growth. So, when you use rosemary to season your dishes, you're not just adding flavor, you're incorporating a valuable ally in the fight against cancer into your meals. Number 2. Parsley Parsley, that green herb often used as a garnish, has some impressive cancer-fighting qualities. One of its key strengths lies in its antioxidants, especially flavonoids. These antioxidants act like shields for your body, protecting it from harmful free radicals. They're really good at stopping the growth of cancer cells and even telling them to self-destruct, a process called apoptosis. Now, let's talk about detoxification. Your body has its own cleaning system to get rid of things that could lead to cancer. And guess what? Parsley helps support this natural detoxification process. It's like giving your body a little extra help in staying clean and healthy. So, when you add parsley to your meals, whether it's on your salad or in your green smoothie, you're not just adding a burst of flavor, you're also introducing a natural defender against cancer and a natural cleaner for your body. Number 3. Thyme Thyme, that herb with a pleasant aroma, has something special that can help in the battle against cancer. Thyme contains a powerful compound called thymol. Thymol has the potential to do something incredible. It can tell cancer cells to self-destruct, just like flipping a switch. This process is called apoptosis, and it's a natural way for your body to get rid of troublesome cells. Thyme is also loaded with many antioxidants, including flavonoids and polyphenols, these antioxidants are experts at neutralizing harmful free radicals, reducing your risk of developing cancer in the first place. So, when you use thyme in your cooking, like sprinkling it on your roasted vegetables or adding it to your soups, you're not only enhancing the flavor of your dishes, but you're also bringing in a natural cancer-fighting agent. Number 4. Oregano Oregano, that herb with a robust flavor, has some remarkable qualities that can help in the fight against cancer. Chronic inflammation often becomes a root cause behind many chronic conditions, including heart disease, type 2 diabetes, neurodegenerative disease, liver problems, respiratory issues, gut problems, and even cancers. This is mainly because inflammation can potentially damage our cells and DNA, leading to harmful mutations that can cause cells to multiply abnormally and rapidly. It can also stimulate the production of new blood vessels that supply oxygen and nutrients to cancer cells, which is also known as angiogenesis. Now, oregano, the herb we're talking about, has a unique ability. It calms down the inflammation and reduces your risk of developing chronic diseases including cancer. Studies have also shown that oregano extract has the ability to prevent the overgrowth of cells and stop the formation of tumors. Plus, it can stimulate apoptosis and prevent angiogenesis, which is great. Number 5. Holy Basil Holy basil has been traditionally used for centuries in various cultures, not just for its aromatic leaves, but also for its remarkable healing properties. It contains special compounds, one of which is called eugenol. Now, eugenol is really good at telling cancer cells to stop growing and even make them go away. This process is called apoptosis, which is like telling those bad cells to self-destruct, 
So when you use holy basil, maybe by sipping on a cup of Tulsi tea or adding fresh leaves to your salad, you're inviting a natural cancer-fighting agent into your body. So why not? Number 6. Astragalus Astragalus, which basically comes from traditional Chinese medicine, has this special ability to make your immune system stronger, like giving it a boost. Now, when it comes to cancer, a robust immune system is a great defense. Astragalus contains polysaccharides, which have been shown to enhance immune function. This way, your immune system can better recognize and fight off those bad cancer cells. Its antioxidant compounds, like flavonoids, protect your cells and DNA from harmful free radicals, and its anti-inflammatory properties help heal and repair your cells and tissues. Some studies also suggest that astragalus can affect the cell cycle of cancer cells, slowing down their growth, and can even potentially kill them. Not just that, astragalus has also been studied as a complementary therapy to enhance the effects of chemotherapy while reducing its side effects. Research in this area is ongoing, and experts are hoping for quite promising results. Number 7. Garlic Garlic, that strong-smelling bulb, contains a special compound called allicin. Allicin is like a healing agent inside garlic, and it's believed to have unique abilities against cancer. Allicin can be really effective at slowing down the growth of cancer cells. It helps to reduce inflammation in your body, preventing your risk of developing cancer in the first place. In addition to allicin, garlic also contains other organosulfur compounds, such as diallyl sulfide. Studies show that these sulfur-based compounds have anti-cancer effects. Allicin, in particular, has been studied for its ability to inhibit the growth of cancer cells and induce apoptosis or programmed cell death. Some studies have also shown that garlic compounds can inhibit angiogenesis, the process by which new blood vessels are formed to supply tumors. By disrupting this process, garlic can help slow cancer growth. So when you regularly have garlic in your diet, you're giving your body some extra support in staying healthy and lowering the risk of cancers. Number 8. Green Tea Green tea is rich in polyphenols, with EZCG being the most studied and prominent among them. EZCG has demonstrated anti-cancer properties by inhibiting the growth of cancer cells, promoting apoptosis, and blocking the formation of new blood vessels that supply blood and nutrients to tumors. Some studies also show that green tea supports DNA repair processes, which are vital for maintaining genetic integrity and preventing the formation of cancerous cells. And lastly, green tea promotes your body's natural detoxification processes by enhancing the activity of certain enzymes that help eliminate carcinogens. So green tea can be a very healthy, tasty addition to your daily routine that naturally helps prevent and kill cancer cells. But do remember that all the herbs shown in this video are not a magic cure, so you cannot use them for cancer treatment. But you can consider having them as a part of your balanced diet to reduce your risk of cancer and even help with your cancer treatment. Also, always consult with a healthcare professional especially if you have specific health concerns or are undergoing cancer treatment. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel to support our mission to help improve your health. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.